and welcome to Nintendo Treehouse Live. My name is Riona, the rambunctious, and I'm joined today by Ethan, the enthusiastic, and Brandon, the bodacious. And today we are going to be showing you WarioWare Get It Together, new WarioWare title that's coming to Nintendo Switch. A lot of fun, very exciting, and Brandon, why don't you tell us a little bit about WarioWare? I am so excited to talk about WarioWare and share this game with everybody. So, uh, yeah, this is a new WarioWare game, and here's what we're going to do. Part of the fun of any new WarioWare game is the surprise factor. So there's a lot of cool stuff in this game, uh, and we're going to show you a little bit of it. This will be a micro segment to match the micro games of WarioWare Get It Together. Cleverly uh, done, sir. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> uh, so uh, we're going to dive into story mode here and show you just three quick levels uh, in this story mode. Uh, this is just a very small taste. So uh, as you can see, I've played through a little bit of this uh, already. So this is kind of returning to story mode. Uh, you can see my high score off on the right there showing uh, how well I've done in the past. So uh, we're going to hop into Wario's intro games here. Um, and right away, you can see some very different cool stuff happening in this WarioWare game. Uh, character playable, selection. So playable many. characters. <laughs> um, so I have a variety of characters here. This is just who I've met so far, uh, mm -hmm. just early on in the adventure. Um, so I'm going to start with Wario, uh, uh, of course, that makes sense, uh, and play as Cricket and 18 Volt as well. Um, so you're like uh, building a team of three. Yeah, you get to, to pick sort of a small crew to take with you into these micro games, mm -hmm. uh, and they all control differently. And well, I don't want to. I don't. I'll let the visuals uh, do the talking. Yeah. And you, Ethan. <laughs> <laughs> and for uh, anyone who's not familiar with micro games, they're basically these little bite-sized games, uh, really fast, really hectic, really chaotic, and the goal is to finish them as quickly as possible before the time runs out. Yep. Uh, but part of the fun is figuring out what exactly you have to do. So right. hypnotize here. Yep. And each micro game has a way to succeed and you know if you don't do that specific thing you will lose one of your little life bars down below as you can see um but we're already seeing though uh the different characters and this is new to the warrior series the different characters behave and act differently um and have different abilities so young cricket there we just saw um has the ability to jump high we've got uh, 18 volt here is uh throwing these discs from his head um, and that's going to change the way that you play the same micro games. Right. Um, different characters know. are going to play them differently. Mm. And you never know who you're going to get. So it's always, you know, completely random. Maybe you are really familiar with the game. You're used to playing with a certain character, but now you have a completely different character. Right. So, so you pick the three, but then you don't really have control over which character is going to play which stage. Mm. Brandon is just knocking it out of the park here. Yeah, I mean, if you can everybody quiet. I have to focus. <laughs> no talking for the rest of the segment. <laughs> oh, okay. You can do it. And I love the different art styles that are on display. Um, you definitely need to expect the unexpected. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And it's fun, you know, when you win, there's a different animation. When you lose, there's right. a different animation. Right. And both are super wacky and fun to look at. Like, oh, I, I love this one. Look at this little Mario. Oh. Well, it's super fun to just watch these games because, <laughs> you know, you get to pay attention to all the detail that's happening on the screen. Whereas when you're playing, you're, you're really focused on, on trying to succeed. So, you know, it's maybe only in repeated playthroughs that you get to see those details. But. Yeah, I appreciate you guys helping uh, uh, explain what's happening because I'm entering a fugue state the longer I play these yeah. micro games. <laughs> now Brandon has made it to the boss <laughs> level of uh, Wario's, Wario's level. And this is a little bit longer than the other micro games, as you can see. Uh, each level will have a different boss level, obviously. Since this is Wario, you can That's see close. you've got the garlic volcano in the background. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah, Cricket uh, controls very differently than, say, 18 Volt or, or WarioWare would in this stage. As Wario, I'd be floating around uh, and having a little more control and a little easier time. And as 18 Volt, I'd even be stationary and only have to worry about hitting my target. But here, I actually have to actively <laughs> move Cricket around <laughs> platformer style, which is very different for a yep. WarioWare game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you'll find, I mean, some characters are, you know, really well suited to some stages and, and will make that stage a cinch. And then, you know, another character, based on their particular ability, might have, you know, a little bit more of a challenge on that stage. So, again, it adds that extra layer, not knowing what to expect. <laughs> okay, we're going to stop there. Okay. Very nice, a, a brief break in the action. Because in a, a first-time playthrough of story mode, uh, you would actually get to the boss, uh, the boss micro game and then back out and, and get to explore other levels. If you return, you get to just keep playing and see how high your score can get. Right. So instead of playing more and revealing more of those micro games, we're going to save that for you guys for later. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we're going to hop into a different level here. We're playing oh, Mona's I love games. Mona. Mona. Actually, Brandon, I don't want you to have all the fun yourself. So do you mind if I 
hop in here as well. Would not mind at all. In all fact, right. that's one of the other cool features of this WarioWare game, uh, is that two-player has been added. So there's co-op mode where you and I can both uh, play together. So I'm going to turn on two players here. Awesome. And so right now we're playing on one system with two Joy-Cons, but right. we could also play together local co-op. You know, if I had my Nintendo Switch Lite with me, I could connect to you, we could play together. And dibs on Mona. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's fine. Uh, I'm going to play as Wario again. Um, yeah. okay. And one other cool <gasps> thing about two-player mode is there are some characters that are built for two players, like Dribble and Spitz. Right. So we can each control Dribble and Spitz, who have very similar moves, right. uh, but uh, are, are two completely different characters for player one and player two. So yeah. uh, I'm going to pick 18 Volt again. Yeah, so we'll Dribble will always shoot to the right, and Spitz will always shoot to the left. Brianna, are you ready? I am so ready. I don't know if you guys are ready. We'll see, though. Oh, there's born ready. And this adds, you know, even another layer, kind of. There's going to be two players on screen at the same time, uh, each with their own abilities. Um, and you have to, it's hard, you know, <laughs> here because you have to work together and make sure you're not at cross purposes, you know, talking, communicating is important. Um, Stay away from those dust bunnies. Oh, oh God. So we can see Wario's got his... Well, he's got a jetpack, I guess, and he's uh, he's got his dash he can do. Meanwhile, Krygor can kind of swim through the screen like you saw. Now we've got 18 yeah. volt, and Mona can ride her scooter and then and uh, throw a boomerang. So there's again lots of difference uh, differences in the way the characters behave. You guys are aging such quick this. work. Yeah, wow. Nice <laughs> yeah, it's it's there's so much variety in how these games are presented. The normal loop is completely different now. That there's playable characters. <laughs> <laughs> and you'll see the uh, Mona's level, the theme is kind of uh, everyday life. Yep. So she's got, you know, just the, oh, oh, gotta get that away. Yeah. Nicely done, guys. I <laughs> love that guy. Yeah, we've got little dusters down below that represent our lives. Yep. Uh, some craziness going on in the background. Yeah, oh, so okay. much detail to, to notice. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, I use my boomerang. Yeah. Well done. Very nice. <laughs> and I, I love the different options there are to play two player, right? So you can. You can be doing this via um, you can be doing this via uh, your you know same system like you guys are doing, sharing uh, two Joy Cons, or you can be doing local wirelessly, you know, on two different systems. Artist um, forbidden. <laughs> Watch out! Oh god! Oh, nice. I claim this nice. one. <laughs> Don't get chomped. This hole was made for me. Yeah, you can see Moda's constantly moving there, so uh, puzzles like that can be a little tricky if mm -hmm. you're supposed to get in one specific spot. Oh, Tiny, get rid of the spider. <laughs> we did. <Wow. laughs> oh. Nicely done. Okay, we're gonna stop there. We're gonna okay, stop there. That's, okay, that's enough. Again, there's a lot of yeah. really cool stuff in here. We do not want to spoil too much. It's hard to, mm -hmm. to stop though. You get in such a rhythm. I know. Really yeah, like I said, you enter the white wear <laughs> fugue state, <laughs> <laughs> uh, which there is no known uh, uh, treatment for, unfortunately. <laughs> just uh, more WarioWare. Keep playing more WarioWare. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so there's one more thing we want to show you here. It is a very cool returning element uh, to WarioWare, and that is 9Volt's level. Yes. 9Volt uh, is the Nintendo fan of WarioWare's crew. Yeah. Um, and uh, in this in this game, like in other WarioWare games, 9Volt has built some games based on Nintendo classics. Mm-hmm. Um, these are very, very cool, uh, very and cool. we do not want to spoil all those, so we're going to show three of these, yep. just to give you a taste, yep. to give you an idea of what these are like. Um, I don't know which three they're gonna be mm -mm. because the game likes to shuffle them. I know so. which ones I want them to be. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we'll see. Well, we'll see if we get them. So uh, <laughs> Rion and I will hop in here mm. uh, and tackle three of these Nintendo classic All right, so you're gonna I will play. Pick your your three characters again. I will play as Nine Volt since this is his level. Um, nice. All right. And do dribble will, and spits. Yeah, let's do dribble and spits yeah. again and 18 Volt. And one thing I, I like about uh, co-op. Oh, go ahead. Oh, sorry. <laughs> one thing I like about co-op is that. You know, even if one of us fails or loses the other one, as long as the other one wins, then yep, that's right. It's a success. That's you a can point. see we're skipping the cutscenes as well. We don't want to ruin any of those cool character moments yeah. for you guys. Find ghost. Find oh ghost. Okay, There's ghost. Yes. Got him. <laughs> cool. Yeah, you can see his nine volt. I'm always yeah. moving on a skateboard. Deliver. Oh god. Oh, this one's always. Oh. <laughs> you got oh. this. Come on. Yes. Nice. Nicely You're done. Welcome, Fauna. Okay, what's the last one? What's the last okay, one? What's oh, gonna, what is it our gonna last be? one going to be? Oh, oh man. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, uh, uh, Ice climber. Uh, Come on, get up there. You can do it. Woo. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Nicely done. Whew. That's all we're going to show of the Nintendo games in 9 volts. Ah, I want to play more. I know, I know. Yeah. There's a lot here. There's a lot to do. So but much I don't want to spoil the surprise for everybody. <laughs> so, uh, that's it for this this uh, quick look at, at, at or this, this micro segment to match the micro games <laughs> of WarioWare. Get it together. Um, Cannot wait for everybody to get their hands on this and play it later. It's going to be very, very cool. So a lot of fun. Yeah. So thank you so much for joining us today. Wait. And one more thing. I can't let us end this segment until 
all of us have given our best. No. Wah. So yes. We're doing this? For we are I, doing I, it. I mean this. We're not letting anybody <laughs> leave. Brandon. I will hold you down in your chair <laughs> until you do this. So, uh, I'm going to kick it off, right? Okay. Please do. Wah. Wah. Wow. <laughs> it's very satisfying. That was Thank great. You. Thank you. Not going to forgive you for that. <laughs> now we can end the segment. Okay. Uh, WarioWare Get It Together is coming out on September 10th and it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, please stay tuned for more Nintendo Treehouse Live and coming up next is Metroid Dread.